Hello and welcome to a very special Big Brother tonight. At 7.30, the housemates won't know what's hit them when they lose a Logan in our surprise twin eviction. Watch live as for the first time, the housemates can choose who they want to evict from the house. Should their votes be a draw, you will have a chance to evict one of the Logans during a five-minute SMS-only vote. But right now, time to catch up with the last 24 hours in the housemates' lives. Previously on Big Brother, in return for a tennis ball, Kate and David were given a personal challenge. If you can return to the diary room with all of the checker pieces in the next 10 minutes, Big Brother will supply a tennis ball and batteries. <laughs> oh, no. I don't know what's going on. I don't know why wrecking the game is funny. Big Tonight, the Big Brother Brigade hits the great outdoors. But can the girls cope without creature comforts? Blowing rain. I am not made for camping. And is Rita about to push them over the edge? I can hear everything you're saying. Do you realise that? Please. Yeah, but it's not, I heard I'm before too. I'm going to have a nervous breakdown. Any water, boys and girls. Oi! What happened? Uh, it's true. Uh, <laughs> they're starting to become really aggressive. They're getting very aggressive. I think they're getting too big now. Uh, uh, yeah, you were really away. angry yesterday. Last night, Kate and David angered Tim by ruining a game of checkers he was playing, and it's still on his mind this morning. I can't be angry at you just because you were giggling as you did it. But I giggle at everything. I know, but I, that was my rationale in my head behind being angry at you and not at Dave. And I said to him, I can't be angry at you and not at Dave. But the fact was, I was angry at you and not at him. And, and that goes to issues that I have with you that are, got nothing to do with what happened last night, you know what I mean? That was why I felt... That's why I went outside. What does that have to do with? Oh, I just, I don't know, just generally. Why do you have issues with me and why do you not address them with me? At the end of the day, I like you more than you like me and that causes me some deep down, some frustration. And to like you more than you like me means that in situations like that, you know, I have a, a, another little emotional sore that gets rubbed, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Do you know what I'm trying to say to you? Yep. Is if you dug someone that didn't dig you, what you would do is, is the thing that you learn when you're about 19, and that is not to keep putting yourself in a situation with them. Yeah, so you can see them every day, and obviously you're in a situation where you can't And go that. away and completely leave them alone and forget mm. about them. Mm. Play more fish in the sea stuff, and you get on with it, mm. and within three weeks, OK, it hurts a bit, it's gone, and when you see that person again in three months, you go, oh, this feels so much better, you know what I mean? I feel so much more comfortable with my emotions. And, and so, in some situations, that's the appropriate way to deal with it. Mm. You know, because you have big emotions as well. Yeah. But anyway. No, I do know. I do. And I am sorry for putting you in a situation that's not... Oh, God, it's the whole checkers thing. I really am. And I'm sorry if you felt that I didn't handle it in a situation the same way you would. Well, mate, I, look, I, you know, I've said this to you and it's probably getting embarrassing, but I, I, to have so much time for you and something like that really doesn't mm. bother me. It's, it's... And vice versa. What, the main thing, what the main oh. thing, what the, what the main thing I'm trying to say to you is that having those feelings and knowing that to some degree they are the root of what I'm feeling... Yeah. I don't feel like having a public stoush with you because the reason I'm annoyed and that has nothing to do with the situation at hand, you know what I mean? Yeah. That, that's, I suppose that's where I'm coming from. Come from. Mm. And I do think you're completely honest with your feelings and your emotions. I do.
I know it's very, very hard for someone who has feelings for someone to tell them openly, and I know that, but it's frustrating me. Time and time again, it makes me feel guilty for not liking him in return, like it does. And I know that might sound really, really childish, or I don't know, but and it just feels like every time it says it, it gets heavier and heavier. And like, so I don't know if he keeps telling me in the hope that I'll turn around and all of a sudden we'll like him. I just don't know how to deal with it. And it's getting to a stage that it's really upsetting me. And I feel horrible for running away from him just then, but I just do not want to hear it again and again. He knows that I don't feel the same way in return. And I'm just... <sighs> Good morning, mm -hmm. Chef. What's going on today? Heaps of stuff, mate. You've missed heaps. Where's Kate? She, um... She's in the dining room. I thought we agreed we were going to call her hate. Coming up, an en masse eviction. You are to pack your bags for an extended stay outside of the house. Yeah, this is our thing. To a big Rita, dial 1902 555579. To a big Tim, dial 1902 555573. Or SMS their names to 191010. The housemates have to master basic survival skills for this week's task, and Big Brother has set up camp in the backyard. This is Big Brother. Housemates, you are to pack your bags for an extended stay outside of the house. Yeah, this is our Which bag we pack? Big little bag. Oh, that's mad. Oh, it's not. Oh, I'm excited. This is Big Brother. Oh. Your time is up. All housemates to the garden immediately. Oh, yeah. Hi ho, hi ho. Hey, 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 hey. Where do we go to the toilet? The only thing worried about the toilet, especially this is after Danny. Oh. It's a holiday. This is Big Brother. <laughs> Melanie to the diary room. So funny. You're joking. Yeah. <laughs> you are joking me. Bloody hell. Yeah. Bloody hell. Good. Good. Housemates. Follow these instructions, taking average walking steps to find your treasure. Yeah! I love okay. this. What is our starting point? Um, the starting point is stand in front of your store door with your heels to the front of the red pathway. Okay, yeah. The housemates have been given a compass and orienteering instructions to follow. It's an average step. So who's going to step up? Can I Everyone. Due north, five steps. So go. Go. Which way is north? One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Yep. I was always taught you Due west, seven steps. Family one. to compass housing and turn the three, base plate so it four, remains five, on there. Six, so the seven. Next plate. one. <laughs> let's, just, let's just hunt for it, you know. 20 degrees, four steps. One, two, three, four. Yep. And then it says dig to find your treasure. I say we lift the rock. Yeah. And dig! 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 They would have dug it this deep, for God's surely. I mean, this is like in Afghanistan or something. <laughs> hey! What you got? Yay! Yeah. What you got? Yeah. Lock. Follow these directions oh, to, find, to use the key to open your door. Where's the thing gone? Oh, oh, it's out. Oh, no. That is it. <laughs> the housemates now have to follow another set of instructions to find a key to open the box. Yes, I've got it right now. Yeah, I can. 
I'm gonna fucking climb up. Give me my rope. I'm Everyone swearing. loosen me up. Six. <laughs> <laughs> just, can you just move out of the way? Sorry. It's, it's just next to the right of that palm tree. Where are you standing, dude? Really? Is anyone telling me to stand on top of here? Yep. Yeah, I reckon it's more west. I reckon it's honestly lands in here, dude. Oh, the crap. Is that rain? Is that rain? Oh, Timmy, get some wood. Oh, yeah, get the wood in. Quick. Don't get too wet or then you'll get cold. That's good idea, get the wood. Done well there, Simbo. Let's do it again. Yeah. We need to do it again, but I swear that the three steps, like we either came to here and the three steps were under there. We're going to have to do it more proficiently. I know. Oh my god, I found it! Uh -huh, she found it, haha! -ha. I go. knew it was yeah. Yeah. Housemates, you are to make a traditional Australian Damper. camping meal together. Oh, I, I told you it was going to be damper. damper. Next on Big Brother, they're not all happy campers. But people give special Wait, requests as well. I can't tolerate it. I can't. Not out here. I'm not the only one that says it. To a big the Logans, dial 1902 555576. To a big Melanie, dial 1902 555581. Or SMS their names to 191010. Tonight we'll be losing a Logan in the surprise twin eviction at 7.30. Will the housemates vote for friendship or strategy? If the vote is split, you will have the chance to decide who is evicted with a live five-minute SMS vote. But first, back to The Daily Show where all the housemates exit the house to spend a night surviving the wilds of the garden. Where am I going to hang up? Now, take the fire still and strike downwards, showering the dust with sparks. The housemates have been locked outdoors for the night to test their survival skills for this week's Big Brother Brigade task. I want to go to the toilet. Ew. <laughs> you all right there, Mel? Yeah, I'm just trying to work the toilet. <laughs> Put a hand. Shut up! Hey, let me give Mel a hand. She's out the toilet. Baby, okay. look, hold on. <laughs> I'll get a towel. Oh no. Uh, <laughs> Hang on, now I can't even. Oh, this is Quick, so great. embarrassing. Sit before you take your pants off. I can't. This. My mark is there. <laughs> yep. Just cover my head. What do you even know where the toilet paper is? Oh crap, I'll get it for you. Hold Thank on. Thank you. You can't see, man. Hold on. Oh my god, we have soggy toilet paper. No. <laughs> We've got to make it bigger, basically. We've got to make it bigger, mate. Yeah. A lot of those red coals everywhere. They'll still cook like that, though. Yeah, I've often cooked them just oh. like that. Are we going to fry those? Mm -hmm. That's what I'm doing, though. Oh, okay. <laughs> I might take a little bit out if that's okay. I'm frying him. Yeah, no, I'm gonna. I want to fry mine with my sausage because I get the juices. Rita, we have to do everything together. We just can't do anything separate. We can't <laughs> do separate stuff. That's the same thing as when people say, "I don't want this for dinner. I want that." I don't give a f what anyone says. I'm sick to this. We're doing everything together, and everyone doesn't like it. Everyone can. <laughs> we can do everything together. It doesn't matter. Oh. It's no big deal. Smoking meth. That's the same. I'm just saying this when people give special Wait, requests I as well. I can't tolerate it. I can't. Not out here. I'm not the only one that says it. Who else Why is saying it? it? Oh, following me. I can't handle it's it anymore. I can't. Oh, it. Someone's beauty. It's <laughs> called I don't have to have it like that. I couldn't even have none at all. This no big is Big deal. Brother. Vesna, you may not swear. Oh, really? As a result, the brigade is to keep the fire burning until your first meal tomorrow morning. Oh. Easy. Great. Oh, not a problem. Okay, so he's That's it. His now. Oh, he's getting furious. I can't handle it. I can't. I can't anymore. Special. What I want this. I want that. Hey guys, I can hear everything you're saying. Do you realise that? 
Please. Yeah, but it's not hurting I'm now gonna, before too. I'm going to have this breakdown. I will tell it to you if I said just did. Then come I don't know. Yeah, but don't yell off. at me. Talk to me. I heard Mel before I too. I hear everything everyone says. I just can't come over there because I'm I... angry. Don't worry. Okay? Not a case of bark. Talk over, we can make it. I'm sorry for yelling at you, Ed. I'm sorry. I'm just frustrated. I'm Next sorry. I'm not saying it's I'm okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Next I'm not saying it's okay. I'm sorry. It's like always no, say it's no, okay. You can't, you can't say that just like that. You can't because you, you don't you don't understand the pressures. You don't understand, all right? You can't. Don't say you that. You guys don't understand me. <sighs> it's simple as that. But we're trying to talk to you about your reading. You close off. You go, I don't want to talk about it. No, I don't. You, you do. do. All right, I'm all going up on me. No, we're not. So we're, not. Me. we're not, Rita. We're not. All right. I promise we're not. Because I've heard every single one of you. Every Rita, single one of you. There's no so. way that we want to gang up at all. You know what I mean? It's not about not the fact really. that we write people promise. off at promise all. Promise we're not. Can you not touch my back, please? Promise. Why? Because I don't feel like having my back rub. Okay. But thank you. Okay. Yeah, what? Well, I just feel like I'm up. You guys aren't perfect you. either, you know. But this is what we're saying. Oh, we're oh, not oh. saying that we're perfect. With you, I feel there's zero compromise. It's Rita's way or the highway. It's not. Well, I feel it's that It's never way. been like that anywhere it else. It has, because I've ever. asked you. No, that's not fair. But it hasn't, ever. I can easily say that. <laughs> but then that's a really good thing. But then in this situation, you have to reassess. True. But I'd rather people come to me directly, like V does. Every time I try to talk to you, Rita, you always... I, I try to give you advice Don't or something. Don't make excuses, because I listen to everything you say. Oh. All right? All right. And I've lost all right, respect for you then, now. All right, then the first, all right, then if you want to be respect. that way, if you want to be that way, no. then be that way. Why don't I... Because I've listened to you, everything you say. And I told you what to say about me not listening, because I know when I listen and when I don't. Right. I've tried yeah, to let people understand that. And, and I, how about you trying to understand me, or you I trying to understand me? I told you that the other day. Okay, we need okay. plates, Timmy. Okay. Breathe through it. Walk away. Just walk away. Oh, you're hot, mate. Roger. Oh, don't worry about it, mate. I hate people like that. Oh, I don't need to deal with people like that. Oh, no, you don't. Don't worry. Yeah. No, there's a pull out. I also understand why Mel gets upset when I haven't said one bad thing about her. Because she feels like she's tried really hard. I just With you. Said, mate. I'm not stupid. There you go, chuck the sauce. And why don't no you guys one, think no I am? No one does. No one does, Rita. Yes, really, no one I'm does. Not, no, they don't. Uh, Kate, Kate, Kate. I, no you guys don't realise how much Timmy? I see and how much I see through people Timmy? and how wise I can be. Tim. But I don't Tim. speak in a way that might make me sound wise. It's the way I think. Yeah, it's different. Oh no, babe. How dare she vilify me? That's how I feel. Yeah. So I'm just not going to speak to her. I don't need people like that. After the break, things go from bad to worse. Vesna, come in, you get a call. To evict Vesna, dial 1902 555578. To evict Christy, dial 1902 555568. Or SMS their names to 191010. In just a few minutes' time at 7.30, it's time to say goodbye to one of the twins in our Big Brother surprise twin eviction. First, though, let's see how the housemates are coping without their creature comforts. Bloody rain. I was about to say, it's it Bloody rain. The housemates are sleeping outdoors in swags tonight and are unimpressed when the weather takes a turn for the worse. Vesna, come in, you get a cold. Have you noticed this? it takes a couple of two minutes? It's like BB's controlling the weather. Hey, do you know what? It so is. Hey. Is it warm over here? Yeah. That's Away awesome. from the rain. I'm yeah. sick of everyone whinging. Well, I've had my pathetic cry. No, no, I wasn't referring to you, babe. Just, I really can't stand Rita. I'm cold. I'm freezing. I'm freezing too. 
I don't want to go to that toilet because it's full. I really don't like this task. Same, I hate it. You try to see the fun part of it, but Yeah. <laughs> not seen it mate. Yeah, I'm not made for camping. I'm really, I really, I will admit, first to admit, I am not made for camping. Neither am I. I have my I skin regime. I cleanse, I tone, I moisturise twice a day. I don't do orienteering to find treasure. <laughs> I know. So what's a good old bush song we can sing? It's a jolly swag man. Yeah, okay. yeah, we're not going to sing the whole thing. We're just oh, okay. How embarrassing. We're going to make sure we're going to make it cool, don't we? We're going to save the dream. And as he watched and waited till his billy ball, you'll go waltzing Matilda with me. Waltzing Matilda, waltzing Matilda. You come waltzing Matilda with me. And he sang as he watched and waited for his billy ball. You come waltzing Matilda with me. Good night anyway, guys. <laughs> Sleep me in a... Oh, you don't. Do you know I've never slept in a beanbag, guys? Bean bag. Yeah. Oh, I mean a swag. Sleeping bag. Oh my. Play a game. Haven't. Amateur. No. God, kebabs you have. Imagine you started pelting here like it. It's just the wind's not there though. It's yeah. just so still. So I'm not moving. <laughs> this is great, guys. This is so great. What happens if it pees down? Oh, we just cover it. This is all you do. <laughs> Over. Like this. this is so funny, I'm sorry. Like this. Lift him up. I feel like a bloody ham sandwich. Like these cabs. <laughs> this is us. We need a little stick. That's it. Because what I do is you can make a little tent head. This is just here. great. Oh, I love this. A little bit of rain never hurt us. Yeah. Alright. Stay tuned because coming up is Big Brother's surprise twin eviction. Who will lead the house, Greg or David? To evict Kate, dial 1902 555563 or SMS Kate to 191010. Boating costs 55 cents, including GST. Calls from mobiles higher. Boating and SMS lines close at 8.15 p.m. Australian Eastern Standard Time this Sunday, the 24th of July. For terms and conditions, go to bigbrother.3mobile.com.au.